Fighting out of Manchester, England, introducing Campbell, the Hurricane Hatton. Hatton. Here, boys, bring it in. Let's go, gentlemen, bring it in. Okay, boys, we went over the instructions in the changing room, okay? So make sure you give me a good, clean fight. Watch the low punches, anything from the navel up is good. Watch the kidney punches and watch the rabbit punches to the back of the head. And most of all, protect yourself at all times. Touch them up, good luck. So two lightweights in action. Over six rounds in our second contest of the show here on Before the Belt. Right, Top left of your screen, Campbell Hatton. From Hyde in Cheshire in the United Kingdom, Dennis Bartos in the black trunks from the Czech Republic. He'll move, he'll pop out the jab, jump in and six KOs, so the nine wins that he has. Six of them. So a bit of pop in his shots, but Campbell Hatton, like I say. Baby step, moving along nicely. Starting to snap out the shot thing early on. Good. Instead of snapping them out, that allowed opponents to look for the right hands over the top, the left hooks, the counters, and there's more full. He sets traps. You know, that left hook to the head, and upstairs and dropping to the body, shades of his dad. He's starting to add that to his artillery. Chopping down that right hand now in the straight mark left to the body as you, you mentioned there. Remember so well from his dad and well between his dad and his uncle Matthew in the corner. Four, could be three of the greatest fighters of, of the modern era in Canelo Alvarez. And the back out Floyd Mayweather with a double right hand to the body. Sinks Dennis Bartos down to the canvas. Still a minute 35 to go. In round number one, a little breakthrough here for Campbell Hatton. Yep, he's a good body puncher, and that's the exact tactics. Oh, oh six it shot. into the body, and Bartos down again. And is he going to get up this time? He looks badly hurt. I don't think he's going to make no. it, Darren. Good victory that for Campbell Hatton. He's done exactly the right thing, Chris. When you've got someone like Bartos that likes to move, Use the body shot, slow the legs down, stop that movement. And that was a lovely left to the body. So accurate, so sharp with the shot. Set it up with uh, two rights to the body before the drop bar toss. And that was a good victory, Chris. Intelligent stuff, good work by Campbell. Well, as soon as they got going, it was all over. And Dennis Bartos is still down. We'll try and get some pictures of how he unraveled in just a few moments time but for Campbell Hatton well that's the most comfortable nice work of his career so far absolutely he's looked comfortable all week he's enjoyed being on the road we've seen him in Bilbao in Gibraltar and now in Abu Dhabi he looked comfortable all week and that's shown in his performance this evening you can see the damage it's done to the right side of Bartos really nursing that Rib cage on the right, showing that he does have power. Campbell, he's it's just now a good teacher as well, isn't he? Of that, for oh, that absolutely, shot. absolutely. And you can see there's power there. I say it again, we can't get too carried away with Campbell. There was limited amateur experience. I can see a man just behind our desk here in Joe Cordina. The amount of fights that he had, it really is that foundation you need. But that is a class shot. That is delivered correctly look at that beautiful shot so quick like I say when you you're snapping the shots out properly with real speed and accuracy that's what can happen ladies and gentlemen referee Shaz Junab calls a halt to this contest the official time of the stoppage one minute and 44 seconds of round number one your winner by knockout he's still undefeated Campbell, the Hurricane Hatton.